Hello, welcome. Take a moment, try this problem out, and then press play when you're ready to solve it with me. Okay, so a culture starts off with 12,000 bacteria. Uh, we can call this our starting population, n sub zero. And we don't know the exact rate of growth or what's going on, but we can use e to model a population growth so times e, okay? And then we've got some rate, we don't know it, but in this case, the rate is multiplied by the time. The time in this case is one hour. So let's use one, let's use the number of hours as our reference point. Okay, so then what does that equal? That equals, well, they tell us that in general, this leads us to a population. They're telling us after one hour, we get 25,000 bacteria. So we can solve for R here. If we divide both sides by 12,000, e to the r is 25,000 over 12,000 to the natural log of both sides, and r is the natural log of 25,000 over 12,000. That's going to be our rate, and I'm just going to leave it. I'm not going to estimate that. I'm going to use that variable, uh, that, that value of r, excuse me. So they want to know what's going to happen after three hours, so then we just plug this into our calculation, starting from 12,000 times e to the rt. Well, r is this thing, natural log of 25,000 over 12,000 times, what is that, times three. And that's gonna get us some final population value after three hours, n of three. So we've got a calculator, let's use it. So first of all, the natural log, the natural log of 20, let me just enter this in here so you can see it. Well, okay, the natural log of 25,000 divided by 12, that's not 12, 12,000, that's our R rate. So enter, and then if you click store, you can store as a variable, I'll use A, enter. Now, we do 12,000 times second natural log is e to the power, what power is it to? Well, it's the power of A times three. So we get about 108,506. All right, hope that helped.